Welcome back, cozy dreamlights, and welcome in if you are new. My name is Elle Serene, and today I wanted to give you a tour of my completed peaceful meadows biome in Disney Dreamlight Valley. Before we jump in, make sure you hit that like and subscribe button and turn on notifications so that you do not miss my next build. This also helps to support the channel so that I can continue decorating for everyone. The Autumn Core Market is one of the first builds I created in Dreamlight Valley. We have a curvy path full of pumpkins and autumn foliage that leads to a market and sitting area. This is the centerfold of my peaceful meadows. If we head to the left, I have created a very natural path that encompasses the pond in this area. This is Goofy's home. I'm sticking to a fall theme in this area. We have pumpkin patches here, and I also incorporated the blueberry bushes as it matched Goofy's color palette very well. Since pumpkins are my primary money maker, I wanted to incorporate them in my meadows, and then also there are some in the Forgotten Lands, but I do have a farm on the other side of this build as well, just so that I can continue to keep earning those dreamlike coins, the money in this game. On this side of the pond, I opted for a very natural looking path in case I didn't want to go all the way around, so it's still functional. and entrances on both sides of the market to transition to the other builds. I wanted to keep my meadows practical and functional. To the right of the market, we have my cottage core farm plot build featuring Mickey's house. I used the cute picnic blanket from Frozen by the pond and the hay bale items to give this build that cozy farm feeling. This area is functional as I use it to farm pumpkins and then any other crops that I need to plant for quests, etc. If you're looking for a functional yet aesthetic crop or farm plot area, I do have the speed build for all of these posted, including this farm core plot speed build. All you have to do is go to my page and look at my Disney Dreamlight Valley playlist. area in the meadows is a fairy core build featuring the fairy blossom home that is a home that you can get in the premium shop this is one of my recent builds i used a plethora of different foliage elements to line the pathing but the main focal point would be the vine flower lamps that line the pathing this beautiful item gives an ethereal vibe which is perfect for fairy core and I did keep this build practical by making sure that I left room for any mining nodes in the peaceful meadows in case any quests come up in the future where we need to use them. Next, I'm going to show everyone the areas in furniture mode.
One thing I really love about Mickey's farm core plot is that you get a really cute view of it from the plaza in the gazebo sitting area. Again, if you're interested in checking out the full process of my builds in the Peaceful Meadows, you can check out my Disney Dreamlight Valley playlist or just scroll through all my videos. All of these builds have the full process uploaded. Next, I'll just run around each build at sunset and at nighttime so you can get a feel of how the lighting changes. I really love the market at sunset as well as Goofy's area at sunset, but the fairy blast home at night just completely blows me away and it just feels very magical. If you've made it this far and you're interested in making some cozy friends or just getting inspo from others in the cozy community, consider checking out my official Discord and Facebook group. Both are in the description down below. You can also follow me on my Instagram, Pinterest, and Twitter. Thank you so much for 10k subscribers. I had never imagined hitting this milestone when I first started my channel, and I couldn't have done it without all of you who support me and enjoy my content. I have appreciation for each of you, and I feel truly grateful for this experience. Thank you to my channel members, and thank you to those who cozied up with me today in the Peaceful Meadows tour. I hope you all have a lovely day, and I will see you next time.